Welcome back my duelist friends, Casual Duelist here, and it's the end of the week, so we're here for card of the week. So, I wanted to pick something that again works in Speed Duel just as well as it can work in the main game. Uh, and still, of course, have like a relative budget feel. Uh, so I went with the trap card Lost Wind this time. Now, I did play this uh, a little while ago. I don't think I, may, I played this in any main game decks uh, recently. Uh, but again, since this deals with special summoned cards, uh, this card is exceptionally good and also exceptionally easy to obtain, my friends. So real quick, let's go over the, uh, this is obviously the Speed Duel one. Uh, but the effect here is going to be to target one face-up special summoned monster card on the field, negate its effects, and have its original attack power. So just right there, um, the only real limitation here is it needs to have been uh, a special summoned card. Uh, so in speed duels, this is mostly just going to be like extra deck stuff. Um, but when you're dealing with the master game, uh, this is every deck, just generically. Um, and that's maybe save for uh, like monarchs maybe. Um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, if a monster is special summoned from your opponent's extra deck while this is in the graveyard, except during the damage step, you can then set this card, banishing it when it leaves the field. So you actually get a second shot, uh, if the card is already in your discard. So we can go ahead, we can actually double disrupt on the same copy. So nothing better than a quick double dip. Let's just go ahead and set that there. Uh, let's talk about that. So... Decks like, uh, if you had the chance to set up against something like Dragon Link, uh, this would be like a good budget version to Impermanence, um, except Impermanence uh, can be activated from the hand if you don't control any cards, so it's great if you're going second. Um, but it's essentially just effect, is just effect Veiler at, at any other time. Um, with the additional of, uh, again, if this was the Impermanence, uh, the spell trap card that may or may not even be in the same column uh, on the opposing side could also be kind of null void. Um, so Lost Wind, kind of better, definitely cheaper, and we get to use it twice. So let's give you guys some prices. Now, I went on TCG Player, I, I just typed in Lost Wind, so I got some stuff out of other games too. Um, right here we have the OTS uh, Tournament Pack Super Rare, those are like a buck forty. Uh, you get this. You get this exact one right here. This is like two seventy five, not terrible. Again, you get this common if you bought Speed Duel Battle City boxes anyway. So again, like I'm sitting on four of them. One of them just happens to be a secret. Um, we do have the 2017 Mega Pin, uh, Mega Tin pack, uh, sixty seven cents. Uh, again, the Battle City box common sixty cents. Uh, the common from the Shadal Structure Deck, $0.37. Cents. Uh, Raging Tempest, regular rare, $0.71. Cents. And even the Dual Devastator, uh, which was just one of uh, Konami's like, best sets, in my opinion. Um, $0.79. Cents. So, for the most part, this is definitely... like We can get this... Uh, I did like the Shadal Structure Deck one. If we got three of that, it's basically a dollar for a play set. Um, so, again, it's very budget-friendly, and it's still going to perform uh, the same way that it would against any other deck. Um, what makes this more fun than, I think, in permanence, um, and again, I'll be at the caveat that we do have to make sure that the opponent's card was special summoned, which, again, in the Master game is so much easier than it is in Speed Duels, um, is that we also get to shrink the card, and, and again... Uh, the way that it just cuts that sentence with a period, let's get right in there. Uh, that means it's a permanent while the monster card is face up. It's not until the end of the turn. Um, and neither is the, the, the effect negation. So, like, you get a longer lasting effect so long as you're targeting something that special summons. And again... Uh, Dragon Link does it like crazy. Black Wings do it like crazy. Samurai does it like crazy. Uh, some of the decks I'm going to be showing you guys this next week because I finally got my package in. I'll be doing some S Force. I'll be doing the uh, Soulful Chords finally. Uh, the 
War Rocks, I think they were called, and Spriggans. So I, I do plan on getting those four out. And of course, again, this next week, we do have the God decks. I'm pretty sure that's this next week. The uh, Slifer and Obelisk structure decks coming out. So I'm going to go ahead and get my hands on those. Uh, we'll probably review them. I'll probably condense it into a review of both decks at the same time. Uh, then do a uh, video for each where it's the three copies build. And then another video each where I just build it again. Trying to make it as competitive as possible. And we'll see what how I end up doing. Um, but that is it. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, everybody who's been subbing and commenting, thank you. It means more than you guys will probably ever know. Uh, it really keeps me in the mood to keep going. Uh, even though I like tend not to keep to a proper schedule yet. Um, <laughs> uh, and, and again, thank you guys. Uh, I'm going to skip the rest of my normal thing and just skip straight to uh, you guys have an excellent day. Not just a great day, an excellent day. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Later.